stars, but our galaxy has hundreds of billions of stars. And if every star has one or more planets, you know, there's at least a trillion planets in our own galaxy. I mean, there's just so many of them. But unlike the moon and Mars, we can't send spacecraft there. These stars and planets are just so far away. So we use telescopes to look for planets. And there's many ways to find them, but the main way we do it now, I'm just gonna take a second and explain it. Yeah. But some planets and stars, they're actually lined up just so. The planet is orbiting the star so that the planet goes in front of the star as seen from our planet or our telescopes. And the stars, they're just points of light, but they drop in brightness by a tiny amount, by a percent or a tiny fraction of a percent as the planet goes around. And the planet will repeat every once in orbit. And right now, we have an MIT's leading uh, mission called TESS, like the girl's name, TESS, Transiting Exoplanet Survey Satellite. And although that mission costs a few hundred million, it's very excellent in finding planets. And so we're looking at large swaths of the sky, giant strips of the sky for one month each. And in that data, we have thousands to hundreds of thousands of stars. And our computers help here and at NASA help us find these little tiny drops in brightness. And we have many complicated computer algorithms um, including artificial intelligence, which is our major buzzword in science today, and we find candidates. And once our computers have found all these little candidates, every Tuesday and Thursday afternoon, like a small group of people, mostly young people, sits around in a room, and we go through the ones that the computer was stuck on, and we look through them, and we have a lot of um, data information, and we select out about 100 per week that go to the observers who are doing follow-up work to see if these little drops in brightness might or might not be planets. So every week, we're coming up with basically 100 new signals that may be planets. They're just everywhere. It's yeah. sort of like an American Idol process of <laughs> yeah. seeing them come in and, Except there can are be they going to be stars or not? There can be more than <laughs> one winner. Okay, good. So